Hey guys, it's Alexander Mario here. Welcome back to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie. In the last episode, we finished off uh, Gobi's Valley, I believe. Now, first off, I'm sorry I have to do this so often. That's what happens when uh, you have so many things to do. Um, that these episodes, I'm so they're so late. I always have so many like massive breaks in my in my. Why did I do that? Ugh, gotta, I have to refamilize my controls. Um. I have so many freaking breaks in my Let's Plays, and I do apologize. I always have different excuses. My main one was... My main... My main excuse that I'm gonna use on you today is that... Uh, <laughs> wow. No. The thing is, is that, like, recently, um... I've... What? Well, Jesus Christ. I've just... I just haven't had the time, man. Like... Basically... Wait, do I want to... I don't want to that. I'm pretty sure. So, basically... Okay. First off, game. We're looking for the next... Uh, puzzle for the next level, I think. I hope we're looking for it. Because that's what I'm doing right now. Next level is Man Mouse Dimension. Uh, anyway. So, yeah, so. <laughs> first off, so yeah, I've been away for the most part. I've uh, been on like kind of holidays and that sort of like actually being away on holidays kind of thing. Uh, I think. Ugh, God damn it. I have to get used to the fucking stopping again. Still haven't fixed it, probably we never will. So I don't want to download a whole new version of this just to play the whole game again. Uh, through the mouth, I guess. Uh, so I've been on holidays, uh, then I had to start uni again, which, you know how it is when you start uni again. You kind of got to get into the whole, oh, here we go again, you know, like, starting up the new term, having to familiarize yourself with all the classes. And I kind of, I, I just, I make it my priority, you know. Um, to to get that to focus on uni. Um, let's go this way. What is over there? Ooh, I can't even tell. I'm, not, I'm gonna banjo walk through this, I think. And be an idiot! Oh, okay, that was almost a bad idea. I see bottles. No, I see Brantilda. Um, oh, you know what? I don't think we can go up there yet. No. Oh, hello, Brantilda, yes. The ugly bear, you fitbit freak, is nothing but that stupid something I wasn't reading, I was focusing on not dying. Okay, let me finish my thoughts first. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I've had uni and all that, and then, like, like, I just haven't had time in the sense of which, like, <clears throat> I've been at home, and I've been working on either, like, my other projects, or, can I not get up there? Do I even care? This is where the next level entrance is, but this is not... We didn't open it, did we? No. It's not around here, is it? There's a thing over this way. I'm gonna walk up this way. I, I don't think we can open it. But maybe? Let's uh, try this. Hey! Nice. But I don't believe that this is actually where the jigsaw puzzle is. In fact, I don't think we can get in this yet. I think we need something else yet, no. Um, oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Sorry, I'll get used to the stopping. Hey, one up. Got, yeah, uh, camera, what are you doing? Jesus. Okay. So, yeah. Um, I keep getting distracted already. It's been a while since I've done a proper recording session, as you can tell. Um, yeah, so I've been away, and, uh, and I've been working on other projects. One particular project, obviously was all those TF2 videos, and I kind of want to stress this because I don't I think anyone really got the impression, uh, but like, I want to kind of clear it up just in case that TF2 is in no way going to replace any series, and I, I kind of really wanted to make that clear. Like, TF2 is a side series, but like that weekend when the update was coming out, I really wanted to focus on like full coverage for it, and I spent all my time playing that rather than um, Banjo Kazooie, which is worry what I should have been playing. So I actually don't know where the next jigsaw puzzle is. I have an idea, but I don't know for sure. God damn. Um. So yeah, and like, and then just you know, weekend like. Then last weekend, I went to a convention that's in town, like, and I was away for the whole weekend. And it's just like, ah, no time, man, no time. But today, I have the weekend off. Uh, I should be doing probably more homework, but fuck it. Banjo Kazooie needs me. Alright, uh, let's go to the top of this area. Um, 
and uh, maybe through that door? Oh, there's the cauldron, so let's go through this door here. Yeah. Um, and then, so yeah, so for today, no one's going to be home, which is another big thing for me. I don't know why, but I, I really like to, um, okay, we've got a fucking sea mine that's probably going to try and kill us. I like to be home alone, so to speak. Um, can I just hold down B? Yeah. Uh, when I'm recording, just so I can be as loud as possible and not have to worry about being interrupted, which is something that happens way too frequently. Ooh, I don't think I want to be here, but maybe... Oh, God. It really does sound quite absurd. Adventure of a barren bird. Well, yes, I suppose. Um, but yeah, anyway, enough about me rambling. We are playing Magic Wizard again. Um, although, back to rambling for just a half a sec. I want to talk about Dark Souls, which is this is not serious talk about Dark Souls, this is a series. Um, I, I made like, uh, I made this like update video the other day, which I figured, uh, I'm gonna make it anyway. It's basically just me describing how, um, I was going to, actually I think maybe it's in here? I reckon it might be actually. Um, I was gonna make an update video basically talking about everything I was just talking about then, why I was late in that, and the status of my Let's Play. So, Banjo Zoo is gonna keep going, I just have to record it. I've got lots of episodes of Undertale left, but I was... The reason I haven't been uploading is I kind of want to upload more than just Undertale, just like more than one series, because I do do that sometimes because it's just the episodes that I have and I don't have time to record. But I'd rather have at least Bandit Zui and Undertale going. Uh, I think that is it. Uh, fuck me. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. It's so laggy. Okay. Um. And. Um. So yeah, and like. One of the things I want to talk about about Dark Souls is that game is frightening me in terms of how we're going to... It keeps crashing, for one. Um, can I just... Oops. No, not B. Uh, there we go. Yes, there it is, man. Must have We did it, guys. Hooray! Fuck yeah, baby. Next world unlocked. That took me way too long. Um, and I can't get my thoughts straight, man. It's hard to play games and talk at the same- Whoa, there's a thing over here! I want it! Ah, uh, it's just a moment. Whatever. I am- I don't even care. You guys care? Probably more than I would. Uh, yeah, okay. So, um... Yeah, so the thing is about Dark Souls is, uh, and I might make a separate update video, we'll see. That series is- there's a strong possibility it's actually not going to continue. And the reason for that is, that game, I don't know what it is, it keeps crashing on me. It's either because I'm recording or something, but whenever there's like too many particles or something on the screen, it crashes, or like the frame rate's too bad. Which really worries me, of course, because for those of you who know the game, there's a level later on, which I won't spoil, I guess, but it's infamous across the internet for having terrible frame rate. And I just think, how am I going to play the game? I, I Basically, I had an entire failed recording session where... I was just trying to do this area over and over again, and I just kept dying and dying because my game was freezing and crashing. And I ran out of humanity, and I was actually like, really pissed off. I'm like, it's not fucking working, I can't play this game. Uh, I have a couple ideas to fix it, but like, I don't know, man. I'm kind of a bit scarred from that whole experience. Um, so I don't know what I'm going to do about Dark Souls. Like I said, if it has to retire, I'll probably try and find something to replace it with. Um, but uh, yeah, I do apologize. But Banjo Kazooie's back, so there is that. And probably a longer episode today as well, considering I've been lost for so long. I was lost, but now I'm found. That's not how that song goes. But we're heading towards Mad Monster Mansion, which is a lot of people's favorite level in the game. Uh, and unfortunately, the, the part of the game where I actually become the most unfamiliar with, which is unfortunate and fortunate, I guess, so it's more of like a sort of, oh, cool, genuine experience, hell yeah, but also a sort of, I'm going to be lost and don't know where I'm going. It's always sort of been a thing, I find, with Let's Plays, is like, and this is why I always Let's Play games that I've, or generally always Let's Play games that I have played before. Um, sorry, my phone is buzzing, I'm going to shove it in my pants or something, so it feels good rather than bad. Okay. <laughs> Um, way! First off, let's go to let's see a little introduction. I 
fucking love that. That's just that kind of like horror start. Um, yes. What was I talking about? I've already forgotten. I apologize. I was focusing on the music because it's awesome. The music in this game is amazing. Um, oh yeah, I was talking about like Let's Plays. And so here's the thing about Let's Plays, uh, my Let's Plays at least, is I always make content that I want to watch. Hey, we can do that. Although I don't think we want to go in this house yet. Okay, can even break the window. Let's go in, Nancy. Let's see what happens. Aha. These two guests are rather dumb. Let's make sure they're unwelcome. Okay, so if I remember, that guy in the middle there is called Napper. And he's asleep, so... Yep. Who woke Napper while he's sleeping? I can hear someone down there creeping. So his thing is, as soon as you touch the floor, he'll wake up. So we have to find a way to uh, get to him without him waking. I do. Like, I remember things about this level. I'm just. Um, I don't remember how to do the whole thing. I wonder what happens to go through this window. Anything different? Why yes, we're in a completely different. Ah, Jesus Christ! Ah, he scared me. Um, yeah, so anyway, as I was saying... Huh? Are you a thing? That, that looks very suspiciously out of place. Um... Eh. I don't trust anything, man. Can I just jump through things? Uh, as I was saying, yeah, so like, I try and make less plays of videos that I want to watch. And generally I don't necessarily like watching blind playthroughs, which is like, what appears to be the kind of trend in YouTube right now. And the core reason for that is, if you're playing the game blind, chances are you don't know the game. Or like, don't know- Oh, fuck you, man. Badass bat. You're not... Uh... Yuka? I think so. Get it, ukulele. <laughs> anyway. Um, I actually forgot which one's which. It's been a long time. I'm just waiting for that game to come out. That's another thing, I'm trying not to see too much on the game, because I do want to play that blind, interestingly enough. Because that is the game where I, like, okay, so there are games where I really enjoy seeing genuine experiences for. And recording that genuine first time experience, but at the same time, if it's a really old game like Banjo Kazooie and stuff, I feel like it's probably more annoying to watch playthroughs where it's like, um, they don't know what they're doing and they're lost and they're confused, and in some cases, which I won't name, but I'm sure some of you might be able to figure out it's certain uh, Let's Plays or YouTubers, if you will, um, who, uh, so I gotta poop into this. Fuck. So you gotta poop into these things here. Yeah. Alright, uh, can I do it? Nope. Oh, damn it. What the fuck? That should've worked. Come on. Yes! Thank you. And they say thank you, but it looks, sounds like fuck you. And that was a big issue about that back in the day. And gravestones come to life. Because fuck you. Get out of here. Two hits. Alright. So, as I was saying, um, yeah, and, and like with old games, it can just be a little bit frustrating. And sometimes people, uh, they, they blame the game for their own incompetence, so to speak. And I think that's really, that, that that's, god damn, I'm pressing the wrong button. I think that's really like a kind of bad state to be in when you're, you've, you haven't played a game and it's because you don't know the controls. And, and, you, and you, well, you start doing badly because you don't know the controls, and you start blaming the game for it because you know when you're doing a let's play show, there's a, there's a lot of pressure uh, to want to kind of get it, um, you know, get things done quickly or whatever have you, really. Um, and that's sort of the reason why I just like I just like to make sure that I like I don't know I like to go into games knowing what I'm gonna do so I don't seem completely incompetent. We can get the game rolling. I can talk and not be too distracted, even though that's exactly what is happening. Because I like to ramble about other shit rather than what is happening in the game immediately. Um, like right now, for instance, like all we're doing right now is just trying to poop into all these pots because I do believe we will get ourselves a jiggy. Yeah, thank you too. Um, these fucking gravestones, man. I like how the gravestones come to life. I'm not like a zombie or something comes out of the ground. Ah, uh, dear me. But I do think there's a secret around this. Fucking. Ugh, it's so hard. Eh. Take my poop eggs. Thank you. Thank you. It's still one more over there. Um, I reckon that gravestone's gonna come to life. Not that one. Okay, wrong. Eh. Yeah. Here. Get out of here, you freaking fool! Um, but yeah, that's just kind of my stance on like 
uh, blind Let's Players versus like, you know, I don't know. I used to call, I used to actually say that there was a distinction between a uh, playthrough and a walkthrough. Where a playthrough is really that looked like a winning. Um, no, that's not gonna help anything. Where a playthrough is when you're playing through it for the first time, and a walkthrough is when you're actually trying to guide the the, the people through the game. Um, so if I had to make if I had to make an example of other YouTubers, hey, bum ba da da da, yeah. <laughs> if I had to make an example of YouTubers, I'd say like for instance, Chugga Conroy. I think he's one of the best uh, walkthrough people there are because he puts so much work and research and effort into his into his uh, series, and really like researches everything. Um, while yeah, I'm, back. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm rambling. There's a Banjo Kazooie thing we're gonna jump through because I think it's a secret or a required thing. I don't know. Jesus, this is fucking spooky. Gah! Yeah. I don't trust any. Yeah, it is just like a, a little secret thing here. There are kinds of stuff. That picture on the wall there is actually of uh, a character that was supposed to be in what Banjo Kazooie was originally. Like, oh, I forget what it's called. It was basically it was going to be like this weird pirate game. I think it was called like Dream something. Project Dream. It's probably what its test name was. Anyway, and that was going to be the main character, this pirate guy. He actually appears in Banjo Tooie, but uh, yeah. I like that they're kind of little references there. Um, but yeah, so you see, and that, that kind of stuff, like, oh, I know that that's a thing because I've looked into this game. I know that this is a secret here because I know I've seen this game before and I've played this game before. That kind of thing. Which, you know, in a normal walkthrough, just uh, playthrough might just not happen. I don't know, it's really up to preference, and I'm not saying I don't watch playthroughs and stuff, like there are games where I genuinely enjoy watching people's initial reactions, but sometimes I do feel like, um, oh fuck me, okay, this is, this is a ghost who you can kill if you press the right button, which I am competent in. There we go. If you go invincible, you can kill them. I just didn't get the opportunity to. Uh, so we've got to navigate this maze out here, and as you can probably already tell, this uh, episode is longer than it already is. I want to get maybe one more jiggy if I can. Because <coughs> I'm rambling as well, and I like to ramble and talk and, and explain my weird and strange thoughts. Blake. It's not Halloween, <laughs> but I want it to be Halloween. It's already fucking halfway through the year. Can you guys believe that? Jesus Christ, 2016 has sucked so far. <laughs> I was waiting for the good stuff to happen. <laughs> All it's been is like all these like great celebrities and shit have died at the beginning, like throughout the year, and it's just sad. Hello, Jinjo. This is just in a suspicious place. I get a bit paranoid by Jinjo sometimes because I don't believe it ever happens in this game. But spoiler alert for Banjo Tooie: sometimes fucking Jinjos, man, they're not what they seem. I'll leave it at that, actually. But uh, yeah. <coughs> but. Yes, I mean, like, I, I just think that it is for different audiences. Like, I, I'm not against doing play, like, blind playthroughs, and I've already done, like, one or two before. In fact, one of my most favorite series I've ever done of all time is a uh, blind playthrough, which is a Portal 2. Uh, and the reason it's my favorite series is because that is probably, like, I think it, on record, one of my favorite games of all time. And I think it's so cool that, like, that there is a recorded and uploaded series out there of like my initial reactions to one of my favorite games ever. Okay, apparently there's nothing in this hedge maze apart from the anguish. So I'm gonna get out of here. <coughs> uh, yeah. I just figured that there'd be like a jiggy or something in there. Like once you've navigated the maze. I don't know. Uh, but. And, and then, like, there's also, what else? There was Amnesia, which is, like, I think horror games are often pretty good for your initial reaction, so you're not, like, stale to the horror and stuff. So when I played Amnesia, that was the case. I don't necessarily like... <laughs> I don't know, man. I like horror games and stuff, but I don't know if how into the whole... Um, wanting to play them on my channel. Uh, purely because it's sort of, like... There are so many people who play horror games out there that are better than me on YouTube. <coughs> I'm just gonna play games that I want to play, and that's that's basically my whole channel, really. I just play games that I want to play, and then if people like it, then awesome. Can I be the best fucking man ever? Hell yeah, I can. Woo! Get the fuck out of here, Scar. Get out of here. Fuck you, Skeleton. 
He's probably gonna come back to life, isn't he? Yes, he is. Is that all that was there? I feel like, like, a lot of these areas are a bit barren. Like, I'm. Oh. 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 oh you were hiding another skull, boy. Skull, boy, hole, boy. Get out of here. Oops. No? Ah! There's a skeleton! Why can't I hit this over? Do I have to be like the other side or something? Okay, okay, Jesus. You know what? I think this episode has gone on a bit long. So, anyway, I've been Arizona Matter, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.